Hi, good evening. Hello, hello. Hi, teacher. Good evening. Hi, Oscar. Nice to hear you. Good evening. Good to see you. Okay. Tired, Oscar? Yes, teacher. Tired? Are you? Are you tired? Uh, yes. Kind of. Kind of. More or less. So, so means. It's so, so. Good. Okay. Next, uh, let's see. The connected on time is Maria Delmi. Good evening. And Jen C. Janet. Hello. Hello. Hi. Welcome. Welcome to the final class. Today we finish. Are you happy for that? Are you happy that today we finish? Yes, teacher. Of course. All right. Nice. Okay, we should, we should be happy and proud, and proud, orgulloso, and proud, and orgulloso, right? Because you did it, you finished. All right, good, good. Yeah. Nice, perfect, perfect. Okay, uh, today we have the final class, a final activity that we are going to do, but before going with that, and what about the others? Are they in a party? Are they eating in a restaurant? Because today is Friday. All right. Maybe. Maybe. Okay. I hope they are enjoying a dinner somewhere. All right. Ah, there is Carla. Carla is joining. Hello, Carla. Good evening. Good evening. Hello. Hi, Kenya. Nice to see you. We were talking about the, the absent people. We were saying, where are you? Are they eating in a restaurant? Taking a trip at night? <laughs> uh -huh. Okay, because not usual. It's not usual that today we have class because it's Friday. Not usual. Okay, but it is because of the Mother's Day. Okay, good. Um, before starting with the class, I want, I want, um, I want to make you a question individually. I hope, and I would like to hear you in this final class. Okay, uh, I know that you participate. You have been uh, interacting during the class, and that is great. And I want to hear, let's see, uh, Jensi. Okay, Jensi, I select you because of the first question. Okay, Jensi, 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 tell me, what, uh, what did you learn during this course? The things that you learned during the beginner model three. If you don't know how to say, we can help you. You have your classmates, they can help you out. Okay, Jensi, what did you learn during this course, beginner model three? Simple pass, simple pass. We are gonna practice simple pass because the question is in simple pass. What did you, what did you learn? Microphone, microphone should be active. I, I learned mm -hmm. about simple plus. Simple, simple plus. Okay, good. All right. Okay, that's fine. Good start. No problem. Okay, you learned about simple past. Okay, you can mention the tenses. That is fine. But... I don't know. What did you like during the class, during the course, Gen C? What did you like? The activities, the interactions, the websites, the lesson, what? What did you like? Different question. Because and, I, mm -hmm. I understand. Um, okay, perfect. I understood. I understood. 
Understood is a simple past of understand. I understood. E and activities. Okay, good. About this. Okay, nice, excellent, nice. Okay, good. Next, Oscar, what about you? What did you learn? And what mm -hmm. did you like during the course? Oscar, Manuel, your opinion to the class. Yes, teacher, I'm here. Nice. I like, um, I like, um, uh, no sé para decir todo el curso, teacher. Okay. How do we say, como decimos todo el curso? Me gustó oh, todo el curso. I like oh, the I course. course. I liked. I, I like. Like. Uh -huh. course. The whole course. The whole course. Okay. Simple, simple pass. Yes. Ah, yes. I liked. I I the ID, ED, sorry, ED, yeah. correct. Okay. Okay, Oscar, nice. Good, good. Anything else that you would like to add? No. Anything else? Algo más, Oscar? Very general, right? <laughs> okay, but no problem. Okay, that's cool. Okay, good. Luis, good evening. Nice to see you. And Natalie, good Abigail, and Maria Antonia, good evening, guys. And it's very funny. And it's Stephanie too. Okay, good. Uh, Luis, what yes. did what did you learn and what did you like in this course beginning model three? Uh, good night, uh, partners. Good night, teacher. Uh, good evening. Very much in this course and uh, in this model uh, three. Uh, I learned. I learned. Uh, very much content, uh, topics, uh, lectures, uh, pronunciation, very much pronunciation. Uh, your direction is excellent, teacher. Uh, your, your technique is uh, wonderful uh, to, to transmit uh, language, in the English language to, to how uh, I I am I am very happy, uh, but uh, I begin in this way with very much doubt. But now this class is on experience a new breath, a new. Uh, very much. Uh, 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 thanks for the by by, by your time uh, to be part of the class uh, to use uh, very much uh, learning very much I learned very much teacher. Okay, perfect. Thank you, Luis. Appreciate your opinion. Thank you so much. All right, perfect. Good. That is that is the purpose that you learn at the end. Okay, uh, what about you, Carla? Tell me your opinion about the course, something that you liked or something that you didn't like. You can mention anything that you didn't, of course. Not only is positive, right? Not, all, not everything is positive, but you can mention. Uh, I remember uh, I learned uh, about simple past, uh, I remember about simple present and yes no question and double H question. And I like uh, practice more and I, I like uh, to meet you. And, and meet more people, Maybe more classmates, because um, um, there are uh, more classmates. And that's it. Okay, thank you, Carla. Thank you so much. Appreciate your opinion as well. Thank you so much, Maria Delmi. What about you during the course? Mm -hmm. 
the pearl is, is very fine for me in material was como decirlo okay para ser siento so you can tell me in Spanish and I can help you we can lot. help you in okay in English no problem it was a lot material for a beginner really but but I feel I I was um, mistakes I can see my mistakes so, uh, good okay Okay, good. Thank very you. Good. Thank you. Very good. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much. That is the purpose that you check your mistakes and the next time do better, right? Yeah. Okay, because you know, um, ah, this is a mistake. Um, okay, next time I will do it better. Okay. okay. Excellent. Nice. Kenya, Roxana. Thank you very much. Okay, my pleasure. Thank you. Kenya, what about you? Something that you liked? during the course what do you remember something you learned etc can you this is um, in español teacher <laughs> is, in spanish class during the course no 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 me okay. cuesta me cuesta okay okay i understand but remember subject verb complement that is the structure from beginner one in advanced is la misma estructura. Ah, I liked, I learned the classes. ¿Cómo se dice las clases fueron buenas? Las clases fueron malas. Ajá, uh -huh. the classes. No, I, I like the, um, the last class. Uh -huh. uh, Ordinal numbers. All right, good. Directions. Mm -hmm. um, a structure at the past tense. All right, good. Direction. Okay, I, okay, that's it. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. okay, that's it. Solamente decimos that's it. No more. That's okay, it. thank mm -hmm. you. Thank you, Kenya. Directions. <clears throat> okay, directions. Nice. All right, good. Thank you. Uh, Stephanie, he said, good evening. Question for you. What did you learn during the course? What did you like or something that you didn't like as well? Today we finish. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Okay. I like this class. Um, I understand very i understand other adjectives good um, i like um the i no sé cómo <laughs> cómo relacionar la palabra okay pero you can ask you can ask pero preguntar how do you say the mm. interaction ah, okay it's similar interaction the interaction interaction of the class mm. is interesting for me mm. para decirle que ha sido como nos Ha quitado como la, la pena o el miedo de poder hablar. Ok, nice, that's great. Thank you, Stephanie. Ok, good. At the beginning, that's it. Ok, the shame, la pena, the shame. Ok, good. Natalie, Abigail, hello. Natalie, Natalie, can you 
participate in the last question. What did you learn and what did you like? Good evening. Nice to hear you. I learned a lot. Um, I learned. Good, good. Hard, hard for me. Very eh, much. All right. Me cuesta mucho todavía. Ah, okay, but that's fine. Okay, but the purpose is that you continue. Okay. ¿Qué hacemos si nos cuesta? Do we quit? Pronunciamos. Ah, okay. Quit, no, right? No quit. No, continue practicing. Correct. Yeah. Okay. Jensi, Carolina, what did you learn during the course? Thank you, Natalie. And what did you like or something that you didn't like? I like the poems. Teacher, I understood better the past tense. Mm -hmm. y, no sé si puedo hablar en español. <coughs> eh, Spanish class. <laughs> what time did we turn the... ¿A qué hora yeah. la cambiamos? <laughs> okay. es, algo largo, es algo largo. Quizás en nuestra mm -hmm. juventud no... no. No entendíamos mucho esto, ¿verdad? Ah. Porque no le poníamos quizás el interés. Ok. Ahora tradúzcalo. Ah, come on, come on. <laughs> ok. Maybe in intermediate or advanced, you will be doing that. No se preocupe. Ok, that's cool. Ok. You understood the simple past, better, etc. Ok, guys, uh, English is not difficult. It takes time. But with the practice, with the practice, you uh, get better. Mejora. All right, good. So don't quit, continue. Okay. Uh, 9, 6, 9, 16 p.m. Okay, thank you guys for your opinion. I appreciate your comments. And let's go to the final class. All right. This is the Word document. Let's see. Do you see presentation there? Yes, yes. No? Yes. 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 Okay. Go. Let's go directly to the class. Beginner model three. Okay. It says ah end of end of the, of the course. course. Many congrats for the present ones. Okay. Next. Okay. The final. The final thought of the day. Oh. We can read it together. First word says knowledge. 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 Uh, wisdom. Uh, Knowledge and wisdom. To, to, acquire, to acquire. To acquire. Knowledge. Knowledge. One, one must one acquire, study. Study. But, but, but to acquire. Wisdom. wisdom, wisdom one, one must, must Observe. Observe. And if the person that said that was or is, I don't, okay. I, Mary was Bosavant. American, huh? American, American magazine, magazine columnist. columnist in the U.S. Okay. Para adquirir conocimiento, uno debe. Estudiar. Uh -huh. Pero. Estudiar. Para que sabiduría. Ajá. Se debe Uno debe. Observa. Observa. Observe. Ok, that is the, the thing. That was the thought of the day. Take it on account in, in your life. And let's see. Continue. Ok. Academic. Mm. And school. School vocabulary. Vocabulary. And we have educational institutions. Okay, in this link, I will show you, when you open this link, you will see vocabulary. It's important to know vocabulary. Okay, it says in this part, educational institutions. Okay, let's listen and then we can repeat. Educational institutions, kindergarten, preschool education, primary school, secondary school, 
College, further education. Higher education, university education, tertiary education. Postgraduate school, university for students studying beyond degree level. Okay, good. The first word is? Kindergarten. Kindergarten. Garden or? Pre school. Okay, pre or pre? Okay. Preschool. Educational institution. Let's, let's listen. Kindergarten. Preschool education. Ah, okay. Preschool education. Pre pre right. pre ah, okay, pre. Okay. This one? Um, primary. Primary. Primary, primary school. school. Secondary school. Secondary school. College. College. Porter education. Higher education. Higher education. University, university education, tertiary education. education. All right. Post grad education. School. University for, for students. Student. Degree level. Degree level. Okay, good. All right. In in your free time, you can replay this and. Listen, listen many times and then repeat. It's a good exercise. Okay. It's cool. It's cool subjects. It's cool subjects. Subject. Okay. I will play first, only listen, and then we practice. School subjects. Maths, language, literature, science, physics, biology, chemistry, natural science, geography, religious studies, History, Information Technology, IT. Physical Education, PE. Cookery, Domestic or Food Science. Handicrafts, Art, Music. Okay, good. Let's see, a school. Math. Subject. First one. Math. 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 Language. Language. Hey, English, English, right? Language. Language. Language, English language. language, yes. This one? Literature. 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 Okay, Literature. difficult. This kind of difficult. Literature. Literature. Literature, Literature. yes. Literature. Okay, Literature. next. Science. Science. Pieces. Pieces. Biology. Pieces, pieces. I hear pieces. Pieces, no, right? Pieces. <laughs> Um, mm -hmm. P6, 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 P6. Ah, but no, no pieces, right? These P6, 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 okay. This one, biology, biology, or biology, 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 okay. Let's see, biology. Ah, there it is, biology, okay. Biology, this one, chemistry. Uh -huh. chemistry. chemistry chemistry natural science natural science natural science geography religious religious studies history history information technology it it physical education P -E. P -E. P -E. E. Cookery. 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 What is cookery? cookery. What's that? Cookery. What's cookery? Ideas? Cucinero. No. Cookery. Ah, okay. Did you know this? Didn't? Uh -huh. The cookies comes from cookies. We know the cookies. No. Cocina. The skill. Okay. The skill or activity, the skill or activity of, of preparing, preparing and, and, and cooking, cooking food. food. Ah, it's like and chef. Ah, uh -huh, it's like chef, right? Good. Cook. Yes, cooker. Domestic. 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 Or food, food science. science. Food science. Food science. Science. Food science. Food science. Food science. Or in Spanish? Comida. 
Uh -huh. In Spanish, how do how do we know this? In ciencia Spanish. de la comida o uh, ciencia de cocinar. Literally that, literalmente eso. Pero how do we say in Spanish? Uh, decimos uh, culinary gastronomy. gastronomy. Yes, or oh, culinary gastronomy. art. Gastronomy. Correct, yes. Good science, yes. Okay, next. Handicrafts. 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 What is that, handicrafts? Manualidades. Ah, correct. Manualidades, yes. My art. favorite, art. my favorite art. subject, art. Yes. Art. And music. And music. music. Of course. Good, good. All right. Let's see. Um, do you have vocabulary exercises in this section? You can do it in your free time because of the time. We are not going to do this part. But if you go down, you can see this useful language, language. and location. location. Okay, this is about um, some school and subject vocabulary too. Okay, let's listen this one. Okay, let's listen first. Useful language and collocations. Lab work, laboratory experiments, dissection, cutting up animals for scientific research, scheduled lessons, lessons which are planned and written into a school curriculum, algebra, formulas and equations in mathematics, to give up or assign homework, to do or complete homework, to complete high school, to graduate high school, to do, to participate, or to take part in school activities or sport. Tracing, copying, outlining in pencil. Tone deaf, without an ear for music, unable to appreciate or hear different music and notes. Okay, that is the, uh, the audio. And let's see, we have types of schools. See, university vocabulary, et cetera, et cetera. Yes, as you see, you can you can check and learn a lot of vocabulary in this in this part. All right, check check it out when you have time. See, university work, presentations. Yes. What else? Lecture. Lectures. Tutorials. Tutorials. Thesis. Dissertation. 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 Hypothesis. Hypothesis. Uh -huh. Assignment. 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 Assignment or assignment. Let's listen. University work. Let's listen. Presentations. Lectures. Tutorials. Thesis. Dissertation. Hypothesis. Assignment. Okay. Assignment. Assignment, yes. Assignment. Project goal. Project goal. Research. 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 Okay. Research or research. Let's listen. Let's listen. Project work. Research. 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 Okay, good. See, uh, with this exercise, you can listen and repeat and practice in your free time. It has a lot of things, see? Yeah. A lot of audios you can listen and practice. Okay, good. Um, the link is in the presentation. You won't lose it. Okay, next part of the class. What is the next part in A? No, this is not where I left, okay. The next one is listen. Let's listen. Let's listen, listen. a biography. biography about, about someone song. famous, famous story and learn as answering some questions. Some questions. Okay, the famous. The famous person. Famous person in history is. is who is she? Who is she? Cleopatra. <laughs> uh, but not only the compliment, not only the compliment in the answer. 
She is Cleopatra. She is Cleopatra. Better, better, mejor. Okay, better. Cleo, Cleo or Cleo? Cleo. Cleopatra. Cleo. Okay, creo. Creo que Cleopatra. Sí. Ah, okay, I think. Okay. Okay, good. Guys, this is an exercise about listening. We check grammar and we check reading too. Yes, it has different skills. Okay, let me open the audio. I have the audio. Okay, here it is. Okay, first, we are going to listen. Attention, I will play it twice or two times, twice. Only listen, concentrate in the speaking, and then we are going to answer the questions. Okay, ready? Okay. Ready? Yes. 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 ready? Okay, but microphones, yes. remember, microphones, no microphones in this yes. moment. Okay, let's play it. Cleopatra was one of the most famous female rulers in history, and her life story is full of drama and excitement. Cleopatra was born in 69 BCE. Her father was the pharaoh of Egypt, part of a long line of Greek-speaking rulers of the country. He died when she was 18, and she and her younger brother Ptolemy ruled the country together for a while before he sent her away. At this time in Rome, Two men, Julius Caesar and Pompey, were fighting for control. Pompey ran away to Egypt and Caesar followed him. When Ptolemy killed Pompey, Caesar became angry. He worked with Cleopatra to take control of Egypt and kill Ptolemy. Cleopatra became the pharaoh and Caesar's lover. In 47 BCE, their son Caesarion was born. Cleopatra brought peace to Egypt. During this time, she learned to speak Egyptian. Surprisingly, before this time, her family only spoke Greek. This helped her to understand her people and rule the country well. However, in 44 BCE, Caesar was killed. This resulted in a new fight for control of Rome. This time, Caesar's son Octavian was fighting against Mark Antony. Mark Antony began a political and romantic relationship with Cleopatra. They had three children together. In 31 BCE, Cleopatra and Mark Antony fought Octavian in a big sea battle off the coast of Greece. Octavian won and Cleopatra and Mark Antony returned to Egypt. Octavian followed them to the city of Alexandria. Mark Antony and Cleopatra both killed themselves. The famous story is that Cleopatra made a snake bite her. They are buried together in an unknown place. After Cleopatra died, Egypt became part of the Roman Empire. There are many stories, plays and films about Cleopatra. She was famous for her beauty, but also for her political intelligence and leadership. Okay, the second yeah. time, the second time, and then we are going to uh, answer the questions about the audio. Okay, let's see. Cleopatra was one of the most famous female rulers in history, and her life story is full of drama and excitement. Cleopatra was born in 69 BCE. Her father was the pharaoh of Egypt, part of a long line of Greek-speaking rulers of the country. He died when she was 18, and she and her younger brother Ptolemy ruled the country together for a while before he sent her away. At this time in Rome, Two men, Julius Caesar and Pompey, were fighting for control. Pompey ran away to Egypt and Caesar followed him. When Ptolemy killed Pompey, Caesar became angry. He worked with Cleopatra to take control of Egypt and kill Ptolemy. Cleopatra became the pharaoh and Caesar's lover. In 47 BCE, their son Caesarion was born. Cleopatra brought peace to Egypt. During this time, she learned to speak Egyptian. Surprisingly, before this time, her family only spoke Greek. This helped her to understand her people and rule the country well. However, in 44 BCE, Caesar was killed. 
This resulted in a new fight for control of Rome. This time, Caesar's son Octavian was fighting against Mark Antony. Mark Antony began a political and romantic relationship with Cleopatra. They had three children together. In 31 BCE, Cleopatra and Mark Antony fought Octavian in a big sea battle off the coast of Greece. Octavian won and Cleopatra and Mark Antony returned to Egypt. Octavian followed them to the city of Alexandria. Mark Antony and Cleopatra both killed themselves. The famous story is that Cleopatra made a snake bite her. They are buried together in an unknown place. After Cleopatra died, Egypt became part of the Roman Empire. There are many stories, plays and films about Cleopatra. She was famous for her beauty, but also for her political intelligence and leadership. Okay, good. All right, let's see. The questions are these ones. Let me yeah. see. Okay. Cleo. Is Cleo? Cleo. Yes, correct. The, the pronunciation, yes. Okay. Please, uh, Kenya Roxana, can you read question number one? But before the indication, now... Now let's answer the question. Give complement answer. Answers. S plus R plus complement. Okay, what is the letter S? What is the letter S? A subject. The subject, yes. Give complete, complete answers yes, using subjects, the verb and complement. Okay, number one. Number number one. Okay, just uh, let me check. Okay, in in which which year which was Cleopatra born? Okay, in which year was Cleo Cleopatra born? Do you remember any number in the listening? In 69, 1969, 64. Okay, let's see. Let's, let's play it. Let's play it and attention to the number because the, the information we need is the year that Cleopatra okay. was born. Cleopatra was one of the most famous female rulers in history, and her life story is full of drama and excitement. Cleopatra was born in 69 BCE. Okay. 69. Okay. 69. Subject, subject, very compliment. Cleopatra. Cleopatra. Oh, was born. Correct. Was born. Was born. Was born. In 69. 60. 60. 60. Uh -huh. 69. Let's listen one more time. Let's listen. Okay. Is full of drama and excitement. Cleopatra was born in 69 BCE. Uh -huh. Number? 69. 69. B, C, B, C, A, B, C, A, B, C, A, B, C, A, B, Before Christ. A, I don't remember the letter A. Okay. Yeah. But this is the correct answer. Yes. Cleopatra. Can you read it? Uh -huh. Cleopatra was born, born in 69 BCA. Okay, BCA. Okay, good. All right. Uh, let's see. Uh, Stephanie, the next number, number two. Question number two. What age, what, what age was Cleopat Cleopatra when her father died? Okay, what age, can you read it, uh, Gen C? Gen C, Carolina, can you read it, number two? What age 
was Cleopatra when her father died. Okay, when her father died, what was her age? Let's listen. Her father was the pharaoh of Egypt, part of a long line of Greek-speaking rulers of the country. He died when she was 18. All right, answer? No. No answer. No, no answer. Okay, no, no. let's okay, let's listen. I don't understand. Father was the pharaoh of Egypt, part of a long line of Greek speaking rulers of the country. He died when she was eighteen. Okay. She was eighteen. Uh okay, the subject. Subject is Cleopatra. Cleopatra. Uh -huh. Cleopatra. Was Fa the father, because the subject is father. Is okay. We are talking about Cleopatra's father. father. Okay. So, uh -huh. Cleopatra's the, father. The question father. is, what age was Cleopatra? Uh -huh. the, the, when when her father died. Okay. Then the age was Cleopatra. Mm -hmm. Okay, we have no. two options no, to no, answer. No. We have two options to answer. The first option is this one, Cleopatra's father. Uh -huh. the, the, the verb? Died. 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 Uh -huh. When? 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 When she, when she, and this, the verb? When, when, she was, when she was, correct? Was 18, 18 years old. Pretty young, right? Pretty yeah. young, bien joven. Okay, yeah. this is the first option in the answer, correct. And the other option, the shortest, la más corta. Cleopatra was. Uh -huh, correct. Cleopatra was, was 18, years, 18 old. years old. Okay, good. That is the second one. That is the shortest. Are the answers correct? Yes or no? This one? Is it correct? Yes? It is correct. And this one? Okay. It is correct too. Okay, two options, but they are the same. Okay, good. Yeah. Nice, nice. Uh, let's see. Ta -da -da -da. Maria del Carmen, next question. Question three. Who was, Who was Cleopatra? Brothers? Mm -hmm. Her Who brothers was? was. Okay, Who was? Cleopatra's oh, brother. Uh -huh. brother was okay. Ptolemy. Okay, let's listen. Let's listen. And she and her younger brother Ptolemy ruled the country together for a while. All right, there is the answer. When she was 18, and she and her younger brother Ptolemy ruled the country together for a while. Okay, Tom, what is Ptolemy. the answer? Ptolemy? How do you write Ptolemy? Uh, that's difficult. Uh, Cleopatra, Cleopatra's brother name. Because I Ptolemy. want to know. Ptolemy. But in, in English, in English is different. P -T -A. Ah, okay, there it is. P -T -A. P -T -O. O L A M K. Okay, the last the last letter is the last one. Uh -huh. P T O P T H L L M E M M Y Y. Correct. Okay. Her brother. Her brother was. Ptolemy. Ptolemy. P T can you can you spell it? P T O T H O L A 
L L O O M M M Y Y Okay, let's see -da -da -da. Is that correct? Yes, it is Okay Ptolemy was her brother Was no Her brother way. was Ptolemy Correct Or her brother was Ptolemy Correct See, simple past Verb to be, simple yeah. past Verb to be, simple past this one is simple past, but in in the tense, the tense, simple past tense, because of the verb, irregular, see? But verb to be, simple past, etc. Here it is. Okay, question number four, question four. What country? What country? What country? Home, country. Home, country. Run away, away from. 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 Okay, de qué oh, país? Uh -huh. De qué Italy. país? Pompey. Pompey was. Huyó. Uh -huh. Okay, let's was... listen. Let's listen. Before he sent her away. At this time in Rome, two men, Julius Caesar and Pompey, were fighting for control. Pompey ran away to Egypt. Uh -huh. Egypt. Ah, okay. Complete, complete answer. Cleopatra? Mm, do no. we do we talk about Cleopatra in this part? No, 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 no. No, right? Correct. No. no. What country did Pompey? Uh -huh. Who do we talk about? De quien hablamos? Who do, do we talk about? About Pompey. About Pompey. Yeah, okay. Pompey. Uh -huh. Pompey. Yo creo que salgo después de... Uh, yeah. Microphone, please. Microphone. Uh -huh. Pompey. Run, From? run away. Run, run run away. away. What okay. is the simple past? Simple past. Because oh, you have the auxiliary. See? Did. What is the simple past of run? Do you remember the table? Irregular table? No? Run. 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 Okay. Run. run. Run uh -huh. away. Run away. Uh -huh. In the country. From, from to, Egypt. To, Egypt. From to Egypt. Egypt. Correct. Okay. That is the answer. Let's listen. In Rome, two men, Julius Caesar and Pompey, were fighting for control. Pompey ran away to Egypt. Correct. The country was? Was. Egypt. Egypt. What is that country? Egypt. What is the country? Egypt. 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 Correct. Egypt. Okay. Uh, help me with the next uh, question, Maria Antonia, please. What? What? What language did Cleopatra, Cleopatra family speak? Okay, good. Okay. Language. What language? We have the answer in this part. Mm -hmm. We spoke with Cleopatra's family. Family. Family spoke, we spoke Greek. 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 Okay, this is Greek. about true or false. Is that true or false? This answer. Let's listen, let's listen and check. And Caesar followed him. When Ptolemy killed Pompey, Caesar became angry. He worked with Cleopatra to take control of Egypt and kill Ptolemy. Cleopatra became the pharaoh and Caesar's lover. In 47 BCE, their son Caesarian was born. Cleopatra brought peace to Egypt. During this time, she learned to speak Egyptian. Surprisingly, before this time, her family only spoke Greek. Okay, okay. is that true or false? The first true. Egyptian. Greek. False. false. True. false. Egyptian. And then. Okay. Uh -huh. they, but it says they it, Greek. the question is Cleopatra's family. Cleopatra. Not about Cleopatra. About Cleopatra's. Family. 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 Yes, family. Okay. Let's listen one more time and let's check. She learned to speak Egyptian. Surprisingly, 
Before this time, her family only spoke Greek. Okay, true or false? True. 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 Uh -huh. true? Yes. True. Yes. Correct. Okay, it's true. Her family only, only. Is spoke Greek. Okay, su familia solo hablaba. What is Greek? Griego. Griego, correct, yes. So the answer is? True. True, correct, it's true. Okay, uh, number six, in? Okay, the answer is? Caesar was BCA. Okay, let's listen and check if that answer is true. This helped her to understand her people and rule the country well. However, in 44 BCE, Caesar was killed. Okay, true or false? True. True? true. Yes, it's true. yes, it's true, correct. Okay, there it is. Caesar was killed. Was killed. Was killed. Was killed. Okay, yeah, correct. Okay, it's true. This is the year. Number seven. How, how many man Mar Antony Mar Antony Cleopatra how okay the answer that we see the children. three children okay let's listen and check this resulted in a new fight for control of Rome this time, Caesar's son, Octavian, was fighting against Mark Antony. Mark Antony began a political and romantic relationship with Cleopatra. They had three children. True or false? Hello, hello. Hello, what happened? Hello? Do you hear me? Ah, yes, yes. the connection is, it's kind of slow. Okay, the connection is kind of slow. Okay, let me, hello, hello, let me reopen the lesson. Okay, do you see the, the questions? Yes, yes. sir. Okay, how, good. How okay. many children? How many children? Two, Mar Anthony and Cleopatra. Cleopatra have. How? They have three children. They have. Three children. And the, is that true or false? I listen to children. False. Okay, let's let's listen one more time. The E. Caesar was killed. This resulted in a new fight for control of Rome. This time Caesar's son Octavian was fighting against Mark Antony. Mark Antony began a political and romantic relationship with Cleopatra. They had three children together. Okay. True or false? It's true. It's true. Okay. In the audio says they, they had they children. three children. Okay, good. It's true. And finally, number eight. Did, did Cleopatra and Mark Anthony kill themselves? Oh, okay. Kill themselves. Themselves. What? What does it mean? The question. Can you translate it? Uh huh. Can you translate the question? 
Ahí me ahí vía. Que sí, sí, que sí, que sí, se suicidaron. Y quizás. Marco Antonio se mataron entre ellos. Ah, ok. Si se mataron themselves. Ok, that is the meaning of the word. Eso significa yeah. themselves. Yeah. Y ellos se, se mataron. Correct. Yes. Yes, they did. Yes, they do. Or no, it's they false. didn't. True or false? It's false. False. Let's see. Let's listen. In 31 BCE, Cleopatra and Mark Antony fought Octavian in a big sea battle off the coast of Greece. Octavian won and Cleopatra and Mark Antony returned to Egypt. Octavian followed them to the city of Alexandria. Mark Antony and Cleopatra both killed themselves. All right, there it is. It's true. Ah, yeah, yeah. uh, the answer is? It's true, correct. It's true. They did. They killed themselves. Yeah. Yes? yes, they did. Yes, they did. Correct, it's true. The answer is true. All right, uh, good. Guys, this is how you can practice. I will upload this audio in the in the Google Drive so you can listen practice the conversation you can um you can type it you can try to type it puede tratar de ankyl ptolemy and and type like last night exercise como el ejercicio de ayer all right yeah okay good i will upload uh, that audio in the in the google drive link okay let's see okay no more material Okay, finally, congratulations for, for finishing, finishing the course. The course. <laughs> All right. Okay. Did uh, everyone finish section five and the final exam? Did everyone finish? Yeah. Yes. 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 Okay. yes, teacher. Okay, perfect. Okay, yeah. guys. Congratulations for uh, uh, finishing the course. I wish you um, a lot of success in the next model. And I hope to see you in other levels. My pleasure to be uh, with you in this course. Uh, remember, practice. Practice a lot. And you will improve every day. English, it will bring you, brings you opportunities. And don't forget, okay? Just remember, opportunities for the future, but we need to practice to reach the goals. Hay que practicar para alcanzar los goals. Goals are los goles. Objetivos. Oh, los goles, right? Ajá, los objetivos, goals. Okay, that's right. Okay, guys, um, let's see. Formally, the, the course is done. Good luck okay. for the next one. My pleasure. Thank you very much. Okay. Thank, thank you. It was a pleasure with you. Thank, thank you, teacher. teacher. Thank you so thank much. You, teacher. Thank you, teacher. Thank you, Thank you, Maria Antonia. Thank you, thank you. Jensi, nice, nice to meet you guys and hope to see you next in, in future, future models. Okay? Yes. I can oh, practice. Yeah. I hope so. I hope so too. Okay, practiquen, yeah. practiquen lo más que puedan y ya van a ver que en intermedio y en avanzado ya conocen por ahí. Ah, no, hombre, piece of cake, easy, easy, easy. Okay, <laughs> pero hay que practicar, okay? Don't forget. Okay, good. Nice, guys. Uh, my pleasure. Good night and enjoy the weekend tomorrow, Saturday, and Sunday. See you. See you, see you. See you, teacher. Take Thank care. you. See you, my teacher. Pleasure. Thank you. My pleasure, my pleasure guys. Good night, teacher. A pleasure for me, too. For me, too. Bye. Bye. Thank you. Thank you so much. Take Bye. care. Thank you very much. Take care, guys. Thank you, teacher. Take care. See you, see you soon. <laughs> not, not goodbye, see you soon. No adios, sino hasta luego. That is see you soon, lo veo pronto.
in the northern oh, yeah. world. Uh -huh, but no goodbye. Goodbye, no. <laughs> okay. <laughs> see you. See you soon. Bye bye. <laughs> bye bye. Bye bye. Okay. Bye bye. Okay. Bye bye for tonight.